Welcome back to our favorite game. What's in your F-hole? Thank you for sharing your F-hole treasures with me. I really appreciate all the contributions and comments. So this week we're gonna get to the top five of number five. Both Nancy W. and Tony D. had a lot of experience in the 90s finding pogs in their instrument. Now, if you don't know what pogs were from the 90s, oh my gosh, big hit, and it um, resulted in a lot of elementary school gambling problems. So pogs it is for number five. Number four, how this could even work, I don't know. So I'm gonna need more info from Claire W. on a ping pong ball found in an F hole. Number three, Devin S. had a student who said something was in their instrument. Upon shaking it out, they found a fake nail. Number two, oh, I wish this didn't happen ever, but I guarantee it happens more than once. Paul S., thank you for sharing with us your wad of dried gum that you found in an instrument. This week's number one comes from Becky D. Her late husband Kit um, once found cooked rice and retracted cooked rice from an F hole. Now he had told the student to put rice in there to shake it out to clean out some of the gunk and dust and dust bunnies and such out there. And there you have it. Uh, tune in next time for another episode of What's in Your F-Hole. Thank you for listening to Advice for F-Holes. Please subscribe and share your comments below so we can have a great conversation.